such beauty. This is a discovery. Wow. Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today I am about to feed your eyes with beauty. I hope you are ready. In case you're watching me from other parts of the world, this is Kenya, by the way, and I hope you have packed your suitcases and you are on your way down here to Fairmont, Mount Kenya Safari Club, na new key. As in, Kimon, are you seeing what I'm seeing? I am so swooned and lost for words. Wow. I mean, check out all these activities. From the time the video began, I bet you saw the number of things that you could do over here. See this guy cycling now? Uh-uh, there's wild animals. There's golfing. There's horse riding. There's the maze. Look, you'll be running there with your bay. Eh? You fix your relationships matter. Uh-uh, look at this bridge. Romantic. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we had Patrick who was taking us around and he was telling us about the place. And he was... At this particular place here, he was telling us it's the garden where they grow their own vegetables. So whatever you eat from this place is organic and healthy. You won't have any tummy issues. How awesome is that? Patrick is a really good guide, by the way. When you get down here, just ask for Patrick. He was awesome. Loved him. So he kept on taking us around. Me and my girl. This was a girl's trip. So you could either come solo, come with your girls your bay, your family, just come. I have convinced you enough. This is the reception area. And because we had already booked um, a tour, we, I can't get in right there at the moment, but we will later on. Then these are the cottages. Patrick was telling us about the cottages and he was telling us about the first owner of the Fairmont, who was a white guy who was into acting and all this fun stuff, life and he used to act some of his movies in in some of these cottages, Abby. How awesome is that? So we kept on going. And on our right, he was telling us about the coffee and tea farm that is this you can see. They even harvest their own coffee and tea. Ah! So whatever you drink from there is freshly harvested from the farm inside the compound. As in how awesome is that loved 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 i was speechless i was like what later on in the video you'll see i managed to touch the coffee and just inspect it and i created some beautiful shots you check out my youtube shots you'll see what i mean so we kept on going these are more cottages so enough for everybody to fit in even if you come a thousand people you wouldn't lack somewhere to sleep yeah so the weather was beautiful. This is my girl. She was creating moments. I love you. <laughs> and as you can see, the view is gold. I mean, bloggers, vloggers, content creators, pack your bags. You need to be here. So here, Patrick was showing me the golf course. And as a lover of golf, I was so impressed and excited. I was like, ah. Can you imagine playing golf while facing the mountains? Then I had to go to a I can talk for you people a little bit. Mm, gone with the wind, fabulous. Mm. <laughs> okay, this is zebra poop, just so you know. And I was asking Patrick, can I use some of this poop to create a genius skincare product? You know, you guys know I'm all things skin. Yeah, so... Patrick laughed, by the way. So we kept on walking and walking. Apparently, ahead of us were zebras. So I was too um, eager to see them. So I told Patrick, you know what? We are going to do the walk. This walk, we must do. So, of course, we were gisting about how work is. You know how the hotel industry is. ETC, ETC. And it was just all vibes. That's my friend over there creating moments. Then we got to the zebras. Look at them with their big nyash. I really love zebras, huh? <laughs> so the closer you get to them, they run away. So I, we just had to keep our distance because they're still not familiar with, with, with humans, you know. Yeah. So we kept on going with our journey and there's more cottages over here. These are really extremely private. You could actually order room service as you just stay 
in the hiding as in that just sounds like Vanessa who loves to hide she loves her peace of mind so he kept on showing them to us while explaining each one of them in detail which was so kind of him I was really really proud of him yeah so we kept on going and going ha 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 this cottage looks so beautiful right <laughs> I've just remembered something anyway we kept on going and going, seeing more and more and more cottages. And yeah, Patrick was telling us about a certain fish pond that's hidden around there. We're going to see them later, but then let's keep on focusing on the cottages. Yeah. Hmm. This place is a beauty. It is a beauty indeed. <laughs> so... More cottages, guys. Enough for everybody to fit in. You could even come as a whole church. There will be space for you, you know? Then this is the fish pond. Apparently, there is fish over there. How awesome is that? Imagine sleeping near fish. Ah. Mm. There are certain things that excite me, especially because I'm an earth sign. The earth really makes me happy. If you know, you know. So... We are almost getting to this bridge where I said a little prayer in my heart. I can say it out loud. I was just like, God, I burn every negative bridge that hurts me in any way. And I let it go. And I'm happy and brand new just as he created me. So we kept on going. And he was telling us about the trees. And then he told us about this yoga area where you can just come and do yoga. And he was taking us to the spa so that we could see and have a session. But unfortunately, this is a spa. Someone had a session going on. So it's that private. You can't get in. As in, uh-uh. For people who love privacy, this is amazing. So, yeah. Wow. All I can say is, wow. Look at the beautiful clear skies. Wow. Mm -hmm. then these staircases reminded me of days that i love taking pictures unfortunately i didn't you know <laughs> ah, patrick came back and told us we needed to go and maybe come back later for the spa session so we left these are more rooms beautiful rooms we actually slept in one of these rooms over here this place is just so magical. It's beautiful. As in, there are monkeys fighting on top of the tree. There are birds kissing as you've seen them. Mm? This is the life, man. When you come to hide here, I promise you, you come back home brand new, refreshed, full of zero baggage, just positivity and 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 the desire to, to do and be better. So we kept on going and going and going. And Patrick was gisting us about the rooms, explaining each one of them in details. And then I spotted this Oibo family and I was like, wow, they came from all that far. Good for you. I love you. Mm -hmm. I zoomed them in. Like, good for you. Mm -hmm. Kenya is a beautiful place to be. Mm. more people you are welcome by the way so we kept on going this is an outdoor chill sitting area where you can just come sit with your laptop chill etc then we got to the food this is this was the lunch buffet as you all know i'm a food foodie food 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 foodie please if you're a musician and you you you're good at songwriting i need you to write me a song about food ah food makes me happy ah 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 because now me, I will just start singing footy, 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 and make it a kid's song. <laughs> okay, there is more food, enough variety, top notch, amazing, yummy. Ah, this is the place where you just wish, could I just have 10 stomachs? Because in January, I will not see such food again. Look at that chicken. Ah, vegetables, pasta. Meatballs. Uh -uh. I wish I just had 10 stomachs. But unfortunately, you can just eat as much as you can, you know, and that's it. This was the wine area. You all know I'm a wine girl. Dessert. Yum, 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 yum. Ah. Ah. 
<sighs> okay, this was the interior of the place, and then okay, I bumped into bread. Who's gonna eat bread on holiday? Not me, definitely not me. <laughs> okay, I got into the bathroom, had to get a little bit goofy for y'all. <laughs> That's enough, Vanessa. You can leave, go and create more content. Got to the bar, ordered cocktails, then left my phone to charge. Yeah, then later on, she had to show you guys the pool. How beautiful is this? Imagine if you're a content creator, you come here with your bikini. And the waiters are really good. They really help you take pictures and videos the way you want. Unfortunately, I didn't swim. Yeah, too cute for life. Ah, or come here with your bay or whoever, just come. Mm -hmm. Okay, here... We were at the coffee plantation. Of course, Curiosity had to take me there. And these are real coffee. Cute, cute. Then I love this vine tree. It vine The vine means a lot to me. More views. This was the interior and we were headed to the reception. As you can see, guys are chilling. Some are working. And some are just relaxing, waiting to be sent to their rooms yeah this is the reception and yeah check out that cute chandelier that's patrick by the way oh that's a cute piano more interior love this place because it's rustic and really really cute so i had to record it for you all ah photos mm? Then I met this girl who was skin goals. I loved her skin. I kept on gingering her while she was serving me soup. She really tried so hard to hold her laughter in. Last, last, she just smiled. I love your skin, whoever you are, lady. Your skin is goals. Always know that and walk confidently in case you watch me. Yeah. Then I had to laugh. My friend was making me laugh. <laughs> ah, that's my plate. That was like the second um, starter after the soup. As you can see, I tried being healthy. I tried now. I tried. Can't you see those greens? I tried. Then they poured some sparkling wine and sparkling water for us. Aww. We just had a good time as girls bonding and, and just being grateful and thankful to God for thus far. I'm really, really blessed, you know more food this was now the main course ah <sighs> comment down below if whenever you go to such places you just wish you had 10 stomachs i wouldn't judge you we will actually meet and go for lunch somewhere now this was my main place i remembered whenever i'm home i don't eat like this you see there's a way i just balance myself so i ate everything here and i'm going to recommend something when you go here, when you go to this place, sorry guys, eat the pasta and the lamb chop steak. Mm. Then this was my dessert plate. Guys, I filled it up. I am a foodie, unashamed. What's there to be embarrassed about being a foodie? Nothing. Uh-uh. Hmm. Yum. We got to our room where the fireplace was set on. So we had to get warm and cozy because since it's Mount Kenya definitely extremely cold yeah so we were chatting worshiping praying we are blessed like that we are women of god <laughs> children of pastor nathaniel bossy <laughs> yes so we got uh, i had to sorry uh clean off the makeup off my face and then filled in um the tub with water hot water so that i could just relax and enjoy myself as i kept on showering god with thanksgiving what's this video without my legs uh -uh, hot legs i had to show them a little bit some skin ain't no scene ah sinking sinking sink in hmm. i really rested so 
Um, I really struggled with removing my makeup. <laughs> I really struggled because I forgot my cleanser at home, but I fought. Oh, see this dimple girl. Bye. I'm blessed and highly favored of the Lord. Mwah, so are you. Okay, in the morning we woke up so early to capture the mountain. This view is awesome and amazing. I mean, check it out. Wow. 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 Oh. Wow. Wow. I zoomed in the maze. I'm very intentional about it because I want couples to come and bond, bond from there. You fix in your, you fix your corals when you're inside there. Uh -huh. So, last last sunrise came out. As in, what is this? Mm? Beauty. So I had to let the sun soak in my skin. Mm, 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 mm. As I did the walk, 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 I am grateful for life. I am grateful for friends who turned into family. I am grateful for opportunities. I am grateful for happiness. I am grateful even for this sunrise. It was so beautiful, yeah? So we got into the uh, breakfast area. As in A for aesthetics. Just check this place out. Ha. Ha. Haba. Haba. Hmm? And yeah. I was just thinking about food, man. <laughs> I was really thinking about food. And there was enough food. Yeah. The breakfast was awesome. Nothing to complain. I had to fill in some juice for myself so i i had some pineapple and mint good for the coochie good for the skin mm -hmm. then um i went to the cereal area i'm not really a fan of cereals so i'm just showing this to y'all who are fans of cereal so we move then we got to the cheesy dairy area where i'm also not into them just because i am lactose intolerant so showing it to y'all who love dairy products you know yeah then we had the salamis and stuff like that i really didn't bother much about them not that i don't like them but i just wasn't in the mood to eat them yeah so if you love them, there is enough for you and your family and your husband and your wife and your friend and your even yourself. Oh, we got to my favorite part where there was baked beans. Then there was doma. Then ah, I finally got some help. My friend helped me open so that you all could see the variety of food. Yeah. She's such a darling. She really saw I was really struggling with, you know, filming each and every part of it while yet she was still serving herself but she was gracious enough to come and help me and then she offered the sausages i started screaming i'm a lover of sausages yum i had two of those mm -hmm. allergic to eggs so nope <laughs> then brown chapati i eat that a lot at home nope then dengue i'm not an indian nope <laughs> <laughs> ah, okay we got to the fruit area i'm like i eat a lot of fruits at home i eat a lot of fruits at home you know i was really trying to avoid things i eat at home so nope ah we got outside where the chef served me poked sausages and bacon hey, now we are talking <laughs> oh it's unbelievable. I'm laughing right now and it's January and I'm hungry and I miss this food, but I'm fasting. So this was my plate. Quite decent, Abby. At least there's some zucchini there. So clap for me. Clap for me now. <laughs> ah, okay. And then I had to request for some coffee. Actually, here yeah, I was creating a shot. You'll see it on my YouTube shots. Then my friend brought me some croissant, donut, and mandazi. Yeah. 
This was so yummy. Let me tell you, the way this food is cooked, if you go to funny restaurants, you really get pissed. Honestly. So I recorded myself while eating some poisson. Yum, yum, yum. This was a beautiful girl's trip. I am grateful. Thank you, God. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And I pray for each and everyone who desires to travel, that God opens doors for you so that you can get here. Okay, so I got recorded while checking out the views and I literally signed out. Lots of love, light, and good living. Bye.